In the summer of 2013, a road tunnel was under construction in the city of Seattle. This large-scale infrastructural operation is meant to replace the Alaskan Way Viaduct, said to be one major earthquake away from collapsing. With the pressure on, Hitachi Zosen provided the world's largest tunnel boring machine, nicknamed Bertha, to dig the tunnel that would supersede the viaduct. Early into the tunneling operation, Bertha stopped. The front end was compromised and would require repair before continuing. Bertha's cutter drive unit was 57.5 feet wide, 20 feet tall, and weighed a total of 4,410,000 pounds. Now, stuck underground, the only way to get this amount of weight out for repair was to create a recovery shaft and lift the damaged cutter head and its drive unit out. Every day that Bertha was out of commission added to the delay of this tunnel. The repair needed to be executed quickly and efficiently. However, it required partnering up with a qualified team that had the right expertise and the right equipment to lift the cutter drive unit to the surface. The team would have to work on a tight schedule in imminent rainy conditions and be able to coordinate the logistics of over 300 truckloads of equipment scheduled to arrive at the job site. So Hitachi reached out to Mamut. Mamut came up with a solution. Design and build a 4.8 million pound capacity lifting gantry tower system with the ability to lift, tilt, and slide Bertha's cutter drive unit, as well as reinstall it back into place once the repairs were completed. These repairs would be supported by Mamut's cranes and self-propelled modular trailers, also called SPMTs. The team was able to combine top-of-the-line strand jack systems, skid systems, modular towers, and heavy lift beams to create the temporary giant. Then, an additional unforeseen challenge rose up. The foundation of the job site became a concern to the client. The gantry tower would stand on piles that were designed for tunnel stability, not to support heavy loads at height. Under certain circumstances, the lifting of the heavy cutter drive unit could cause the piles to twist, making them unstable, and therefore overloading the foundation beam. This could have jeopardized the entire operation. The alternative was to pour additional concrete, but this would have increased expenses while delaying the project for another six months. Mamut stood up to the challenge and developed a more economical and unique solution a special hydraulic system that would equalize the forces underneath the gantry tower. With 48 hydraulic cylinders evenly dispersing the loads, this was one of the first ever self-equalizing towers to evenly distribute the loads and minimize impact to the foundation. This combination of techniques guaranteed a very precise handling of Bertha's parts and ensured their integrity throughout the whole lift. With a solution in place, and in order to stay within schedule, Mamut decided to collect resources and equipment from all over the world to build the lifting system. Following just eight weeks of design, assembly, and personnel training, the innovative gantry was ready to go. Mamut's team held a pre-lift meeting where risks were properly assessed and shared with the client in order to ensure a rigorous review of safety regulations. And on March 30th, 2015, Bertha's damaged cutter drive unit was raised for repairs. With a single steady and precision controlled lift, the team was able to extract the cutter drive unit from the machine and turn it 90 degrees suspended in the air before installing it onto the repair saddles, all within a period of 16 hours. Once installed on the saddles, the cutter head and its drive unit were separated for repair. For over three months, Mamut's crawler cranes assisted with these repair activities. As soon as the repairs were complete, the cutter head and its drive unit were reunited, and the lifting operation was reversed. The cutter drive unit was carefully lowered back down into the shaft, where it could be reconnected to the machine. This completed Mamut's scope without incidents and on schedule. 
Because of its professionalism, quick response, and innovative engineering, Mammut's team was able to overcome a variety of challenges throughout the entire project, such as having limited time to design, build, and mobilize equipment, operating in a confined location, and encountering unforeseen foundation issues, all within a tight schedule. In the end, their efforts managed to reduce time and cost, promote job site safety, and minimize additional unnecessary delay and inconvenience for the city of Seattle. Mammoth, the biggest thing we move is time.